Uh, good day to you all my viewers and welcome back to my channel today. Uh, my name is Chekube Madichi. Uh, today I want to introduce a, another uh, interesting software that one can use to uh, for data analysis and econometric modeling the one that is called GRETO if actually I get the right pronunciation um, here this is my desktop uh, background and here in my tax uh, bar you can see the GRETO app and I'm going to click on it uh, we are going to be learning how to uh, input uh, data and variable into the work environment and uh, get it ready for subsequent uh, data analysis so i'm going to click on it um, you can see it has opened this is how it looks when it opens so this is the environment and what we are going to do is to import data into this uh, uh, great tool environment for subsequent analysis so what do we do uh, the main thing is to first of all get your data ready in an excel file okay you get your data ready in an excel file this is uh, my data in an excel file it is ready in sheet one of this excel file with variable names and uh, years this is annual data there so from this uh, great environment you can go to file you can see open data uh, what you see here is uh, uh, what has been opened recently recent recently used uh, files so you can see copy of practical which i just shown you in my desktop uh, environment okay um you can also assuming nothing is here already you can also click on a um, user uh, what is it called user profile you can get to anywhere in your computer and uh, uh, pick the data from anywhere it is from your computer okay uh, you can also go to a uh, what is it called uh, uh, document uh, okay you can go to document okay this is still uh, taking us to uh, desktop uh, when you get to users here you can uh, click on desktop that is actually on desktop but uh, what you have to do is to go to uh, format here and click uh, the format of Excel that we are talking about that is not here also so you click again you have the second type of excel and now you can see copy of practical so there are two types of excel files that you can see this is the one of the current uh, uh, format of excel format like 2010 and above and this is the older version so and here i am using the older version and that is why i can only see that when i allowed the xls uh, excel uh, extension so you can click on it and the data is on sheet one and not sheet two not sheet three but sheet one and it starts from column one and row one you can click ok uh, it's telling you here is that uh, first row level 1970 last row uh, last level 2019 so that is the what we have so here i will have gdp mop and top in that excel file and the data are here with the variables under the variables okay you can see all the data okay 
can see everything here can you see that and see top so now this uh, this data has been added in the work environment of uh, Gruto and uh, assuming we want to log them before we use them for subsequent analysis what we do is to highlight all of them and right, uh, right click you can see add logs okay you can see correlation metrics you can see time series plots and uh, every other thing you need you can see all of them here you can see add logs so log has been added to the work environment you can see that and before we finally uh, conclude uh, you know what i actually want to do here is to show uh, you how to get uh, started with a great software for data analysis and that's why i started with uh, opening it from my uh, desktop background and getting to this point so what we are going to do now is to do a simple ols regression by highlighting the log variables and clicking on model so there are certain things you can do here you can see tools you can see data you can see view add every other thing here but we are we are interested in is on model so under this model you can see a lot of things ols other list we are instrumental variable and the rest of them and from there you can click on um, ordinary list square okay when you click on ordinary list square you can see another work uh, uh, dialog box coming out here since we are working on the log variables you can click on the dependent which is log of gdp you add it click on these very two you can add them to regressors you can see everything here so this depends on whether you are working with a robust uh, standard errors and various other whether you are using lags you can go to lag and set it up if you are using lags then if you are using robust standard errors you can check this box if not you continue so everything is ready and you click ok so you can see the result is out the OLS result is out with the P values, T ratio, standard error, coefficient and various other uh, aspects of the regression. You can see R square, okay, you can see F statistic, uh, you can see every other uh, part of the result. So if you want to do further analysis, you can click on analysis, you know, focus, confidence, uh, values. Uh, coefficient covariant matrix coloniality and even bootstrap uh, graph graphs you can also uh, plot the graph of residual uh, fitted actual graph and the rest of them everything you need can also be found in this result environment so this is a simple procedure for getting started with a uh, great tool i know most people have not really heard of this uh, software for analysis but this software is very very unique and offers a uh, more uh, uh, data analysis techniques and econometric modeling that you may not really find in most of the conventional softwares i hope uh, this video is useful uh, 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 i'm going to be showing more videos on certain other techniques of data analysis uh, panel uh, data and the rest of them thank you very much for your time don't forget to subscribe if you are new to the channel uh, uh, share to your friends and colleagues and of course comment anytime i have chance i will go through comments and address all your problems.